is Rita. And so Patty. Also known as Twin, Twin Crunch. Crunch. So today we are making spring rolls. Yeah. Shout out to Kendall, Kendall for requesting spring rolls. And yeah. This is my recipe, my twist, my spin on it. Everyone has their own way, their they own really flavor. Do, yeah. So this is just how I cook mine. For our spring rolls, we are gonna need sugar, mm -hmm. a spring roll wrap, yeah. egg yolk. Egg yolk. Don't want to spill that. <laughs> no. Um, onions. Black pepper. Pork. Ground up pork. You can use turkey or chicken if you don't eat pork. So mm -hmm. either or. Yeah. Uh, vermicelli noodles. Shredded carrots. Last but not least, our sauces, yeah. such as oyster sauce, poison sauce, and soy sauce. Soy sauce. You can get all of this at TNT or like Asian markets or Superstore. My yeah. favorite is Superstore. Mm -hmm. Or Lobla or even Sobeys now, they have all of this stuff. Yeah, yeah. we're just gonna add onions. Onions and garlic, chopped up. And we're gonna stir it in really good. Sugar, one scoop. Black pepper. I love black pepper, so I'm gonna just keep going. Poison sauce and a little bit of um, soy sauce since it's up. Gonna throw in our vermicelli noodles. I already pre soaked these in a little bit of water so it's easier to work with. And I, I cut it, cut them up into like three pieces. Throw in our carrots. A shredded carrots. Yeah. And these are two. Stir it up, mix it in really good. Cause you want everything in there. When you roll it up, you want a bit of carrot, you want a bit of vermicelli, meat, and onions. This is the consistency that I like to, and it's ready to roll. Like it's all mixed in, this color of the flavor. I like, I kind of added more, you know, um, oyster sauce, hoisin sauce, just for the extra flavor. But you could do a test roll when you roll it up, you can just do a test roll and like taste it as you go and then see what's missing. It's all in your preference. Yeah. yeah. If this pastry um, wrap gets dry, you could just put a damp towel on top to keep the moisten. But this is how I roll. I put it on a diamond shape and I scoop just a, a little, this, about this much in. I'm gonna squeeze it in. Don't be afraid to get your hands in and get dirty. And I'll roll it tightly. And I'll just, once I roll, I spread it out. And then once I get halfway, I pinch the side, to squeeze it in some more. And fold the sides like an envelope. And don't be afraid if your spring roll is not perfect. Because it gets eat up, eat up, eaten up pretty quickly. Yeah. <laughs> and then what you do is with the egg, Dip it and put it on the corner, and then just it helps bind it, keep it stayed together. And you just roll it up like that. And here's my first roll. Now we're gonna continue the rest of the rolls. Yep, till this yep. is all done. so much better if you just keep practicing so don't give up and yeah you'll get your donkey biscuits roll <laughs> we're just gonna deep fry and make sure you give it enough space to cook don't overcrowd it the spring roll is floating and golden brown like this is perfectly done. Perfect. Mm. But for chicken, I suggest to like leave it a little longer. Yeah. Look at it. it. Smells so good, you guys. Wow. It's so yummy. And our tip is we put um, a paper towel underneath to soak up the oil so it's not so greasy. 
my god. Looks good, guys. Thank you, Kendall, for requesting this. Well, it's easy. Now you guys can make it at home. Mm. Here are the finished results of our spring roll. <laughs> so nice. This smells so good, you guys. Oh my gosh. All right, guys. So we are gonna taste our spring rolls, and we have a special Zen guest Zen. testing our spring rolls. So. Say hi. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so tip, because this is really hot, so what you want to do, <laughs> if it's too hot to touch, you can wrap it around like this, mm -hmm. and break it in half, and blow on it. Mm -hmm. Here you go, babe. Mm -hmm. He really wants it, he loves spring rolls. Cheers. 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 <laughs> Mmm. Mm. Because we added all like, And our wrapping is really nice. Look mm. at it. Mm. <laughs> Jan. <laughs> you like it now, Jan? <laughs> the reason why we don't need the fish sauce dipping is because it has all that flavor in there already. Because we put the soy sauce. Yeah, it's the already salty. Yeah. The hoisin the, sauce, this, the oyster sauce. This, so you don't need <gasps> Say hi, Auntie Jo. He's a giant star again. He's obsessed with her. Mmm. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. You can't just have one. You need like five of these. Yeah. Cheers. Yuck. Yuck. Mm -hmm. Yummy. Mm-hmm. You like it? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. This is good. Thank you, Kendall, for requesting this. Mm -hmm. it's so good. Mm -hmm. Say thank you, Auntie. Thank you, Auntie. Kendall. Mm -hmm. Kendall. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> All right, guys, that's it for our video. Um, we're gonna go enjoy the rest of these spring rolls. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. good, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Anyways. Thank you, Kendall, for requesting the spring rolls. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If you guys have any more, if you guys have any, any more requests, mm -hmm. sorry, there's food mm -hmm. in my mouth. <laughs> any requests, please uh, comment down below. Um, down below, yeah, then. Yeah, we're willing below. to try more new recipes. So, yeah, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. subscribe. Bye. Bye. <laughs>